Nigerian Nollywood actress Tonto DK allegedly arrested by the Nigerian police force headquarters. Yes, beautiful people, you might be wondering what had Tonto DK done to warrant an arrest from the Nigerian police force. Yes, beautiful people, the Nigerian police force on Friday said it invited Nollywood actress Toto DK to its headquarters in connection. Hear it all, beautiful people, in connection with what? With an investigation, investigation into criminal defamation, cyberbullying, and forgery among other charges that's what i mean say they are accusing total decay of criminal you know criminal offense defamation of character then they talk say she did defame people of their character she did also the cyber bully some people which is then you know saying some kind of things about somebody on the internet and also forgery and you might want to ask what is she forging what document is she forging right now yes beautiful people this is why the nigerian police force has invited her and allegedly by others saying she had been arrested for all this crime beautiful people the invitation was issued on the instruction of the inspector general of police the igp monitoring unit hmm. beautiful people which force pro acp muyowa adejobi confirm is handling the case beautiful people you might be wondering again what has she done to this extent beautiful people it is said and reported that the investigation letter dated August 5, 2024 was signed by the head of the IGP monitoring unit, DCP A.A. Elman, disclosed that Total DK's name appeared prominently in the investigation being conducted by the unit. What are they investigating? Total DK, what have you done? It said, This office is investigating a case of criminal defamation, forgery, falsehood, cyberbullying, and criminal conversion reported to the Inspector General of Police, in which Total DK's name and others features prominently. My people, not be smart thing, knowing fully well who Toto DK is. Like seriously, one would not expect such. But yes, you never can tell who one is until such a news is out on the social media. Is Toto DK guilty of all this offense? Like seriously, criminal defamation, forgery, which is a forging of kind of maybe signature or some document falsehood cyber bullying ha like seriously with all the allegation laid against total dk she was requested to attend an interview with the signed document through the sp aminu abidulai sokoto on 7th of august 2024 to shed more light and defend herself of all the allegations leveled against her. Beautiful people, she was then asked that her cooperation in the regard to all the allegations would be highly appreciated. The ACP Ade Jobi, who said Toto DK was invited as a result of a petition against her also confirmed that she was later being released while the investigation continues so beautiful people she was invited based on her personality she was not arrested immediately they just invited her to come and confirm whether all these allegations that has been leveled against her by somebody are true or 
force. She was only invited to respond to the petition filed against her and she has since left the unit while the investigation continues. Guys in awe, fact still remains that she was invited by the police to, to, to defend herself over all these allegations. Guys in law, defamation of character is a big offense. Forgery of maybe documents or signature is a big offense. Cyberbullying is an offense also, guys. Like seriously, all these are big offense. Could this be that someone is actually trying to bring her down by leveling all these accusations on her or are they true? Guys, remember that some days back, a video speculated online that Toto DK bought a car and was still owing the owner of the car two million. Why the owner is saying that Toto is still owing them two million, and Toto on her other side is saying that he, she has paid forty-eight million, just two million to go, but the car is forty, and that she wants her money back. The owner is saying. Complete the money and let me fix whatever fault that the car is having. Like seriously, this one now, Wahala goes to the market. Yes, on that, in that video, a lot was happening, a lot of shouting and all. Oh, and guys, could this be as a result of that video? Or oh, this is from another person entirely. Who is the person that is reporting Toto? And what has she actually done to deserve all this reporting? Guys, like seriously, this one serious. This one no be small matter at all, at all. Imagine all this allegation. Guys, let's wait for what Toto DK is going to say about all this allegation leveled against her. Is she innocent? Is she guilty? Guys, what do you think? Do you think she is guilty of all this accusation leveled against her? Do you think she's innocent of them all? Let me know in the comment section. Toto DK has been seen in recent time to be fighting against injustice, especially in the case of Mobad. Guys, what do you think? After seeing Toto fighting for justice for Mobad and all sorts, do you think she is guilty of all this allegation leveled against her? Thank you beautiful people for watching, my returning subscribers, old subscribers, new subscribers and even you watching for the very first time, God bless you real good. Let me know your thoughts, like I said in the comment section, kindly hit on the subscribe button if you have not subscribed before, like and share and I'll catch you in my next one. And if you are watching from Facebook, kindly follow this page on Facebook, like and share also.